thank you very much. All right, good afternoon, and uh, thank you for sticking around. For, uh, for those who I already know, great to see you here at the Eco Summit. Uh, and for those who don't know me, I'm Peter Paul, founder and CEO of Scone Energy. And we provide clean energy always. And I'll tell you a little bit why we do that, because the challenge we have here is, is quite big. $21 trillion is needed to get our electricity grids to the level they need to be uh, for global net zero. And you think, why does a SaaS-enabled mobile energy marketplace play a role in the grid? Well, I'll get to that. But let's start with uh, the basics. What is Scone? Scone is a SaaS-enabled marketplace giving flexibility to the electricity grid. So we start with the SaaS component, which is the product that we have, AI-driven software tools that uh, the suppliers that use our platform use to manage their energy systems. And that's what it all starts with, proper management of these energy systems. Because there are so many of them, and there's so much involved in managing those on a daily basis, that if you don't have one place that brings together all of your fleet data, all of your commercial data, and access to business models that would otherwise not be available, this is not going to fly. And the 21 trillion is going to be double. So now that we have the suppliers on board and small rental companies, uh, all the way up to large rental companies and even infrastructure investment firms using this software to manage their fleet of energy systems, we can take the next step, which is the marketplace component. And the marketplace is where we deploy those energy systems. So we have construction companies that want to replace diesel generators to go zero emission, or we have film production companies that want to have a silent film set rather than the noisy diesel generator. They come to us and they go through these three simple steps. Before their project starts, they use our decision tool to decide what energy system am I going to use this time, which is the best cost, but also fits the best with my energy profile and will help them simulate that energy profile in the decision tool. And then once the project starts, we do live monitoring in a way that grows their comfort. And it's really important in this phase of the energy transition to really focus on growing the comfort of our energy users. Then afterwards, they report on it, how much CO2 they saved, how much energy they used, how much cost they saved, and they repeat time and time again. And that way, we make sure that the most ambitious projects have clean power, always. We do that with uh, a dedicated energy expert team that also supports throughout the whole journey. So we're a software company with a human touch. But I started with the $21 trillion of grid investment. So how does that, how does that work? Well, here I have an example of a project we've done uh, the last winter. Here you see a substation of grid operator Inexis in the Netherlands, where at this substation they had congestion. And most congestion issues are seasonal, like this one. So Inexis came to us and they asked, do you guys have enough energy systems for us to solve the congestion in the winter? And we want to stop paying when the congestion is gone. So please take them away again. So what we did on the marketplace, we sourced from four different suppliers the energy systems. They were all connected into our platform. And our platform took care of uh, uh, processing the signals that the grid operator was giving us to solve that congestion. So for as far as we know, this was a world's first where battery containers were de deployed directly at the high voltage substation. So we don't do this alone. Uh, our team uh, is very important in this, and our global investor base uh, is already part of our team. So we have Damen, Case Kohler, Rabobank uh, that joined us early on and last year in our Series A investment, Graduate Entrepreneur Fund, and from the United States, Blue Bear Capital joined us in our Series A round. And that gave us enough uh, uh, capital for now to grow very fast, to grow that SaaS product to new areas, to grow the marketplace where we're already active, and to be the flexible layer of the electricity grid. And it's going so well that we're going to start engaging with investors for our Series B investment, currently expected at around 15 million in uh, early next year. So we have uh, subscription revenue that really powers that rental revenue. I told you we're the SaaS-enabled marketplace. So the SaaS product is that recurring subscription revenue that keeps coming back, and that also powers the availability on the marketplace and powers that rental revenue that we need to really get this to scale. And this is built by an all-star team of experts in energy, uh, 34 people and uh, really from all types of backgrounds, but all experts in electricity. So next round is planned in 2025, but I'd love to meet you all 
to talk to many of you. I've already talked to many today, and I'm looking forward to meeting you all later today. Thank you.